Eric Greitens took pride in that he came from the private sector. Mike Parson comes with an extensive legislative background. KCTV5's Jessica Reyes is live in our newsroom, breaking down what the differences could mean for the future of Missouri. Jess, good morning. Good morning. The incoming governor is a man with many hats, a farmer, a soldier, a lawman, and now a lawmaker. Parson has more than a decade experience as a legislator. He was elected to the Missouri House in 2004, and in 2016, he entered the race for a lieutenant governor. Legal expert David Langston says having someone like Greitens who came from the private sector, it was refreshing, but ultimately it hurt the state. He said Parson's experience as a legislator will create a stability that the state lost months ago. I think the lieutenant governor, now governor, as of 5 o'clock Friday, will do a good job of that. I think he knows how to work with the legislature. I think he will know how to move things forward on things that are important to Missourians. Langston also says Parson isn't using this as a stepping stone for the next thing. For Greitens, he suggests he take this time to figure out his political and personal life. Live in the newsroom, Jessica Reyes, KCTV 5 News. We have complete coverage of the transition of power all day long on KCTV 5. Look for updates out of Jefferson City from now all the way up until KCTV 5 News at 10. We'll also keep you up to date on any time today on KCTV 5.com. Stay with us all day for updates as Grayton steps down.